Okay, so hello guys in this video i'm going to show you how to make this copy to clipboard button using elementor okay so like here you uh, so like here you can see that if i click here the text would be copied uh, whatever text is written uh, whatever text is written inside this button okay so let me go here and click on this text uh, a beautiful alert box will be appear at the top and so let's go here and see if it's working or not so you can see that it is working totally working okay so if you want to add such type of button in your website using elementor then this video is for you so let's start and begin the video okay so for making this uh, here uh, here i had make this uh, full process but i am going to show you how to make this from scratch okay so for making this from scratch let me add a new uh, new page okay so for making this you have to just choose uh, you have to just install the elementor plugin okay so go here go and install okay so let me go here and uh, i'm gonna add here a page uh, let me add a uh, demo you can add the page whatever you want let me go here and add the page okay let's publish okay so let me go here and uh, we're gonna make this okay okay so let's wait for its loading okay so like here you can see that i have a text at the top so let me add a text first uh, copy to flipboard button just make it little bit beautiful okay so let's go here and uh, okay so let's go here and uh, uh, okay okay let's make it okay so let's add some padding okay so let's move to our final process of making this video okay so for making this we have to choose the button attribute okay so let me go here and place it in the center and write it here copy to clipboard button okay if you want to uh, uh, if you want to add some background color in it you uh, you can also add the background color let me add the green color here and uh, when we hover the when we, and when we hover it it will be black okay so you can add whatever color you want okay so let's go to content and make it large okay so let's add some margin to the top go to here and add the margin here okay so like here let's first update the page and make it live okay so like here you can see that our page is live but it is not working right now okay so for making it working we have to use some uh you have to use some javascript code okay because in the uh, because in the elementor we don't uh, we don't have this uh, we don't have this option so for making it working we have to use some custom code okay so let's me go here and uh drag the html widget from here just drag and drop the widget okay so now uh, you can use uh, this this website the very famous one chat gpt for generating the code i had used this website for generating the code okay so let me uh, i will give this code in the video description also okay so don't worry for this okay so let's go here and we have to cop let me copy this last one code and i'm gonna go here okay actually i have already copied this code here so i will give you this code okay. so let me go here and let's paste the code inside this html okay so uh, so uh, at last i will explain the code i will explain the code what is work, uh, what is uh, actually doing in this code okay so i will explain at the last of this video so okay so now we have to add a uh, we have to add an id to this button okay like here uh, uh, like here you can see that uh, here it's a function okay so we have to add this id copy button inside this button okay so let me go to the button and let's go to the advanced and here you have to add the css id copy button okay that's it only you have to add this css button in the copy button and uh, let me go to our html and from here you can see that the whatever text you want to copy by clicking on the button you have to enter here okay so this is the text to copy okay uh, so here it is written that replace with your desired text okay so let me add here 
my custom text to copy it. Okay, so let me do one thing. Uh, let's uh, I change its color. Okay, so let's make it dark. Okay, so it will be much visible. Okay, so now it is much visible. Okay, so first uh, you have to make this button and go here and add this CSS ID here, and uh, and I will give you this full code. Okay. Okay, so let me go to the here and one more thing you have to add here the CSS code. Okay, so I will give you the CSS code all also in the video description. Okay, so for adding the CSS, you have to go to the advanced section and from here go to custom CSS, just paste the CSS code here. Okay, so let's update our page and let's go to our front screen and see if it's working or not. Okay, so let me click here. Okay, so it is working. Text copy to clipboard successfully. Okay. So let me see if it's copied or not. So let's go to here and let's paste. Okay, so you can see that the whatever text which we have written in the code, it is coming here. Okay, so if I show you here, I have written uh, this my text to be my text to be copied, whatever, uh, whatever text. So the same, the same copied text is here also. Okay, so in this way you can add uh, such type of functionality in your WordPress web WordPress website where it is needed. Okay, so if you like our video, subscribe to the channel, like and share our video with your friends. I'm gonna see you next time.